Hello, it's Alonzo Guy, Curtis Henry here with you. Just uh, going to shoot a little short video about how to set up your nuclear effector. Uh, so when you get it, this is all the items that are in the box. So you'll see you'll have a, a nice little screwdriver, a couple of little racks, a uh, power cord, and then this high voltage cable. <clears throat> so after you've unboxed everything, it's time to get it set up. So we're going to... Uh, Move everything out of the way, and we're going to turn the devices around here. And you can see here's the back of the X unit. And then we'll turn the core unit around here. See there's the back of the, the core unit, so we'll focus on the core unit real quick so you can see here. Uh, below this is the on and off button right here. This is where the power cord will be inserted uh, And this is where the high voltage cable will go and again the High voltage cable goes here. So it's easier if you stack it. So I'm gonna uh, stack them on top. So I'm gonna put the, the core unit. Sorry this, the image here On top of the X unit so we can go like that. All right, the first thing I do is I take the the high voltage cable that we have right here and then you just need to match the the ends with the corresponding uh, units you can see here this is the core because it actually has the the holes and that one has the plugs and you just match up the angle and put it in like so and then for the uh, x unit then you just take it again this one has the um, can't get it right in screen there and that has the the plugs and then that one has the the hole so then you just plug it in like so you just kind of want to push it until it's seated nice and tight and that's where the uh, little screwdriver comes into play you can see a nice little I'm just gonna get into screen here a nice little uh, flathead screwdriver and you can uh, tighten it up to um, secure it in there and that just can make sure that it's nice and snugly um, attached so that way that you can send it in there and then last but not least <clears throat> and you'll take the power cord and again pretty self-explanatory you insert it in and now your 40 is now actually all set up and ready to go We'll do a quick, uh, sorry for the camera angles, but now we'll actually have it all set up. We can lift the screen up here and we can reach behind and turn it on. And there you go. So it's time to go through the startup. So again, setting up the device, very simple. Uh, you just need to connect the high voltage cable to the back, just making sure that you're uh, matching the corresponding plug to the correct size. I uh, recommend you screw it in, plug in the power cord, and turn it on. So next video I'll go through how to program the nuclear factor. So um, again, thank you for purchasing the nuclear factor. And, you know, the Lonza guys, we're here to support you with all your transfection needs. Thank you.